Hey guys, it's Daniela. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys a few different ways that you can transform glass vases or, you know, just any old glass jugs that you have laying around your house, which I'm pretty sure we all do. So we're going to go ahead and transform those vases into something pretty that you can display in your house. Before we get into the details of the video, make sure that you hit that subscribe button and hit that thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this. And let's go ahead and get started. In the video, I went over to my Dollar Tree and I picked up a few items that they had there. And then I also just use some random vases, glass vases that I already had around my house and I wanted to transform those and be able to display them in a new way that I didn't have already. So again, these are some super quick and easy ways that you can transform this. So let me know what you guys think about this in the comments and let's go ahead and get started. All right, so we're going to need a vase. I have a small little vase from an old project that I did. You need some spray paint and some black paint along with a small brush. I'm gonna go ahead and spray paint the inside of this. The trick to spray painting is to spray it in small doses. Literally do one layer, even if it doesn't look like it's covered all the way, let it dry completely and then do your second coat. That way the paint doesn't drip. All right, so with the pencil, I'm actually gonna draw out a face. I actually found this picture on Pinterest. I love this line art. I think it's super cool. After I sketch it out with the pencil, I'm gonna take my black paint and brush and I'm gonna go ahead and just trace it. So I'm not trying to be perfect at all. I kind of want it to look like it's just sketched on here very quickly. My face ended up turning out looking mad, which kind of is pretty funny. This is how it turned out. I think it looks super cute. I went ahead and added just some little plants to it. You can add flowers to it as well. You can even leave it empty. All right, next we're gonna take these two glass jugs. You're gonna also need some newspaper or any piece of paper. You're gonna also wanna use some tape and some spray paint. First, you're gonna go ahead and just start ripping pieces off of the newspaper. Literally just take chunks off of it. And then you're going to just tape this around your glass vase. You can put this as high or as low as you want. I actually wish I made it a little bit higher. After it's all on there, you're going to go ahead and take your paint and start spray painting it. Again, do one thin layer and then go over it with the second layer once the paint is dry. I'm only doing two coats of paint. And you can use any color that you prefer. I am so obsessed with the results of these vases. They came out looking so pretty. All right, and last but not least, I went ahead and got this garden dish. It's actually a plastic dish. It's from Dollar Tree, and then this glass vase is also from Dollar Tree. Go ahead and remove all of the stickers. This sticker was actually really hard to remove. I figured it wasn't a big deal. I was gonna paint over it anyway. What you're gonna wanna do is add hot glue or E6000 to the entire base of this, and then Firmly press your dish on top and this is what the dish will look like once it's glued together. Super cute. I'm going to take some white chalk paint, add half paint and half baking soda. 
mix that together. You can actually add baking soda as you go. You want it to be a thicker, gritty consistency. And then with the Morphe brush, I'm gonna go ahead and paint my entire dish. This is what it looks like after one layer. You see that grittiness? I love that texture. So make sure that you add as much baking soda as you need until you reach that texture that you like. Paint the entire bowl inside and out. I'm gonna let this completely dry and then I'm gonna go in with a second coat. And this is the finished result. Oh my gosh. I am so obsessed with the way this dish came out. I think it looks so pretty. I just went ahead and put in some lamb's ear in there and I just wanted it to be a simple, clean look and it turned out beautiful. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. Let me know which one was your favorite. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye.